What's up, YouTube? One's Lunch Garage here. Got another tool review for you guys today. And today, I'm going to be reviewing this Gear Wrench Ratchet set. Now, I bought this set a few weeks ago. It was $90. And you got a quarter inch, three eighths, and half inch drive ratchet. Um, right off the bat, I think these are very good quality. I mean, I was surprised at how good <coughs> these were. I I never really owned any Gear Wrench tools before. I mean, I have some ratcheting wrenches by Gear Wrench. I like those a lot, so I seen these, and for 90 bucks, I'm like, you know what, I'll take the chance. And I have to say, I'm very happy with these. I think these are very good quality. Now, if you compare this to, like, a Craftsman Ratchet, I mean, right off the but you can see this is a lot more heavy-duty than the Craftsman one. And then if you compare it to a Snap-on, I mean, they're almost, I mean, they're almost identical, I guess you can say. This one's definitely a little bit more uh, thicker than this one. Uh, definitely, it's definitely heavier than the Snap-on one, but I have to say, for 90 bucks, it's a hell of a deal. Cause I was looking for ratchets. I was gonna buy Snap-on, but when I saw the prices, they're really high, even for used ones. I mean, people are crazy how much they want for Snap-on ratchets. And I seen these, and I bought them. And I think for bang for your buck, I think these are good. These are really good tools. I mean, and they're just. They're about the same price range as like tools like SNK, which I like SNK too. I think they make really good tools. Um, definitely, I would recommend these for if you're a mechanic or whatever. If you're at a, even if you're like an at-home mechanic, I think these are better than buying like uh, Craftsman ratchets. I'm not like a huge fan of Craftsman ratchets, um, but I'm definitely a fan of gear wrench ratchets. Now I think these are really good, and I'm definitely gonna buy more gear wrench tools. I think they're. <laughs> especially for their prices. I mean, their prices are kind of, you know, they're up there, but it's definitely cheaper than uh, companies like Snap-on, Maco, Mac Tools. Um, <clears throat> they're definitely cheaper than that, but I think they're still a good quality tool, and I would recommend these to anyone. Um, definitely worth the money. So, if you like this review, make sure to subscribe, check out other videos, share this video, and wait for more. Come on!